climbers. Top notch, rugged, professional. For them, fear is a four letter word. The dangers they face, all in the day's work. While they may not be as flashy as others, what they do is vital to the smooth operation of our communications infrastructure. So this video is dedicated to them and all the tower crews who accept the risks to keep information flowing. Good morning. It is early in the morning right now, and we are meeting tower climbers today to go up to Santiago Peak and to um, basically realign our two microwave dishes, make sure that they're peaked. Uh, the one got tweaked in one of the windstorms that happened this past year. And then we're also going to be rerunning cable uh, to our 950 megahertz uh, microwave link. So both of those things will be happening today. Let's go meet the tower climbers. See you in a minute. The first thing after unloading their gear was to work on removing the old 950 megahertz coaxial cable. That cable had been slightly deformed by falling ice in a previous season. We had to try to open up the cable ports to the building so that we could remove the old cable and install the new cable. We discovered that the cable ports are riveted in. That posed a bit of a challenge but one that was easily overcome. Once the cable ports were opened up, it was time to remove the old cable and coil it up for the transport off the mountain. On the new cable, the connector for the tower side was installed, a hoist was laced on, and up it went to be connected. The run was on the outside of the leg, and the cable had to be placed into the cable hangers on the tower leg. Then it was time to work the horizontal run of the cable under the ice bridges and into the building. Once the new cable was connected, we were at least at the same place as we were when we got there. There's some repositioning of the antenna on the tower leg in order to swing it more in one direction, but that was how it was installed 20 years ago, and for now, it's best not to upset the apple cart. Then it was time to peak the 6 GHz microwave link. It was blown slightly off target by a severe wind event a few months back. I was on the ground with the lead climber calling out signal strength while very small adjustments were made up on the tower. Once that was complete, we packed up and headed down the mountain to the studio side. On top of the six-story building where our studio is located, the crew did the same process to make sure that we had the strongest signal that we could with our 6 GHz microwave. And we were treated to an amazing sunset. Overall, the day was successful and um yeah, so we met the tower climbers this morning. Um, I have to say a big shout out and thank you to Vic Solberg and his crew of, of tower climbers. You guys are awesome, you guys are amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you for coming out and uh, helping me get my microwave links all up and working. We got a 10 dB improvement on my six gigahertz microwave link. That's awesome, thank you guys. Um, Send me the invoice and we will get you guys paid because you know, a worker is worth his wages. So, um, thank you guys again. Thank you, Vic, and all of your guys. You guys were amazing. And we also came down onto this side, to the studio side, and kind of peaked this side as well. And um, yeah, I think this microwave link is as good as it was when we first put it in. So, that is exciting. And what does that mean for you guys? Well, that means 
less interruptions and less um, dropouts of the Santiago Peak camera, the live camera that pens and tilts and zooms and all that stuff. So, excellent. It means I get to see my uh, all my telemetry better without any interruptions. You guys get to see the camera better without any interruptions. So, everybody's happy. So, anyways, with all that, thanks for following along. Thanks for watching. Um, if you enjoyed this video, watch some of the other ones. I, I appreciate it. And um, like this video. Subscribe if you're not. And we will see you in the next video. Stay safe. Stay healthy.